Hey there everyone, today is the 15th of June 2010 and today New Zealand plays its first World Cup football match in 28 years. 28. Today we're up against Slovakia, a country playing in its first ever World Cup, at least as an independent nation. So it's an absolutely huge match for, for both countries and I am absolutely freaking out. Let me introduce the settings today. I couldn't make it back to Wellington unfortunately for this match. Couldn't make it to South Africa either. So welcome to Bratislava, the capital city of Slovakia. Thanks to some pre-arranged travel plans that I made about 12 months ago, before any of this World Cup madness started, I find myself smack behind enemy lines for our first match. Beautiful city it is too. Now, first things first, it is stinking hot today. It's like 35 degrees, it's about 10 in the morning, and it's only going to get hotter. The plan for later today is there's supposed to be a big fan park square somewhere in the centre of town, around where I'm shooting at the moment. And there's around about 10,000 people expected to watch it on a massive screen there. So that's where we're going to be heading. We hope to catch up with a few football fans along the way. It shouldn't be too, too difficult. And we'll yeah, see, see what the locals think about the upcoming match. And as for me, I'm, like I said, I'm just freaking out. I'm so nervous about this. I've got butterflies in my stomach. And you know, there's, there's a real nervous excitement around this place. You can just feel it in the air. It's quite amazing. So... You know, I was quite apprehensive about actually coming here at first once the draw was announced. You know, I think, you know, thinking back to the draw, I think most New Zealanders were far more concerned. You know, we didn't want Spain, we didn't want Brazil, didn't want Germany. I just didn't want to get Slovakia if it was going to happen while I was going to be here. But the draw worked out perfectly or imperfectly, depending which way you want to look at it. And that's exactly who we've got for the first game. So, T-minus about four hours. Holy shit. Now, one of the funny things about being here, I've been here for about three days now. A lot of people had come up to me when I was in town watching some of the first matches earlier on. Told me that, hey look, I hope you guys win your first match, which, you know, sounds a little bit unusual given the setting. So, I do have a sneaky suspicion that I might be being mistaken for an Australian. You know, for once that's probably not a bad thing, it might actually be my saving grace. So, let's see how that goes. Although, like I said, I think today of all days they're going to know it. So... Like I say, match starts in four hours, and we're going to go down to the square, and we're going to go and check it out. I can't wait. Over and out. Alright, so we're just a few minutes away from kickoff, and I found myself a fellow Kiwi. How you doing? Hey, my name's Luke. I'm doing very, very well, thank you. Now, Luke and myself, obviously wearing New Zealand flags, we've just been hauled up onto the stage in front of the massive TV screen, and... Given, given an interview to the crowd, how did you find that? Uh, I was a bit nervous, I was a bit worried people would recognise me as the flag, but uh, we're doing alright, uh, they're quite friendly, they're very nice. Uh, they're very, very friendly, and it's a little bit hard to be anonymous in a crowd like this when we're wearing our flags, so, did, did, did we have it coming? Yeah, I guess we Yeah, I think, I think we probably did, so, alright, so we're here, we're on the banks of the Danube, there's a, a magnificent, uh, huge TV set up just behind us here. And it's a bit of a small crowd at the moment, but it's filling up pretty quickly, so there's going to be a good buzz before the game? Yeah, I think so. I think the 1.30 comes and it's going to get packed out there. Alright, now it's going to be fun. Now, what's, what's your prediction? I've got 2-1 New Zealand. That's a brave man. I think I've he's, he's a brave man to come here and he's got a brave score. I like it. Yeah, I think he can do it. Alright, so it, it's a hot day. We're going to go and enjoy the game and uh, probably get ourselves some face, mate, aren't we? Yeah, I think so. Alright, let's do it. Over and out.
I can't believe it. They've just shown the replay. He was offside. Gutted. Three minutes to go. Still 1 0. Come on, you white. Chance. Oh, just wide. Shane Smelts heads it wide. Good movement. One minute to go. Second now. Still going. Blow the whistle. Pulls out. <laughs> oh, you beauty, Winston Reed. Full time, one one. Oh.